Have you ever been in a season where you feel like you are waiting for God? It can feel incredibly painful and frustrating when we seek a quick solution to a distressing situation and an answer doesn't come quickly. But King David encourages us in Psalm 27 verse 14 to wait for the Lord. Be strong and take heart and wait for the Lord. How can you say this, David? How can we be strong and take heart when it feels like God isn't there? Well, David gives us his reason in the verse before. Verse 13 says, I remain confident of this. I will see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. We know that God is good. We can be extremely confident of that. We see it all the way through the Bible. But what we also see in the Bible are stories of sorrowful waiting that turn into amazing blessings. Joseph sat falsely accused in an Egyptian prison for 12 years. He spent a long time waiting for God but ended up becoming second in command over all Egypt because of it. David himself was anointed as the future king of Israel when he was just a boy, but didn't actually become king until he was 30. He had to wait at least 15 years and endure relentless persecution, but God protected him all that time. It will always be difficult to see in the moment, but God's timing is much better than ours. Think of a time in your own life when a situation resolved itself better than you could have ever imagined, because it happened in his timing. It is because of God's goodness that we can have confidence in our waiting. So wait for the Lord, be strong, take heart, and wait for the amazing outcome our good God has in store.